Alright, so I felt like I just wanted to, um, you know, make a video on this game. Because why not? This game's fun. Uh, it's Trimps. And it's not like, it's not like those idle games. Uh, except you have to focus your attention on certain things. So like you have, you have food that you need to work on, you have wood that you need to work on, you have science that you need to work on, so you have to build certain things. This game is fun. This game is all around just real, real fun. This and Swarm Simulator are two games that are really, really fun. It's like, ooh, some of these games are fun. So, as of right now, I have food and wood. That's, um, that's idling right now. It'll take a while to get up to full potential, but at least they're idling right now. I have to focus my attention for building, because I don't have anything automatically building things. Um, and I don't have anything, like, automatically doing everything. So, I can't really fight yet, because I have two trims. Um, but I can deploy one shrimp to fight. And as you can see, I'm actually getting quite a bit of damage done with that one shrimp. So, you can't really fight again. Yeah, you can't really fight again. But I can use a shield. And that way I can get up to that. And then what I can do is I can just you nail know, by a trap. That. What do I get here? Bloodlust. So, now we do the trap, and then we just go here, deploy a trump to fight, and we're out of trimps. <laughs> um, get another build thing. I'm getting quite a bit of um, science here, but I'm not getting a lot of metal. So I think what I want to do is I'm gonna focus my attention on getting metal now. Um, cause a lot of whatnot. Also, I can get blood loss, blood loss here. Um, Book will teach gyms to battle on their own, so I don't need to worry about hitting the fight button whenever I want to. Whenever I want them to fight. Um, let's just focus our attention on the wood, uh, here. For a bit, um, and queue up some traps. We can queue up some traps here, or, or what I can do is I can just saw them and then just wait. Just wait it out until I get, um, the required food. Cause I don't, I don't need a uh, wood. I don't need wood for ballast. But I have six workspaces here, so I mean, that's cool. I would say. I think we got a territory boost. Yeah, we got a battle territory boost. Um, glad enough land to put five more shrimps. Yeah. It does get to a point where you can like automatically create traps and stuff. Um, it's pretty, pretty cool. Oh! We need wood. No, we need food. I was targeting the wrong thing, like a dumb. Like a dumb idiot. Okay, there we go. Auto fight on. Okay, now what we can do is whenever there's enough shrimps to fight, um, you can just automatically have a shrimp you know, fight and shit. I'm actually gonna make a shrimp one of those, so then we can get our food up faster. 
And then what I can do is I can mass click on Lumberjack. Get another Lumberjack. Buy a trap. So what I'm actually doing here is I'm actually getting views up so that I have to spend less time um, targeting the food and wood and more time on focusing on metal and science. So once we're done with that, uh, we can actually focus on, we can actually focus on, um, So we can actually focus on um, more things now. Now that we have our food here, uh, we can create a, another building here. So let's just capture a shrimp. Build a trap. Trap a shrimp. Then what we can do is we can, uh, I think, actually start fighting. So let's build a couple of traps here. After this goes, I think I'm gonna focus my chi and focus more on uh, science. Cause science is what makes everything work. Since there's two trims, uh, breeding is now a thing. Breeding is now a thing, there you go. Um, and they'll idly breed. Um, they were idly weed, so less time focusing on um on um building traps. Am I right? I know those are upgrades for like increasing breeding power and stuff. Although we can build a hut, a hut will have some more trimps, which means more breeding power. Yeah, which means more breeding power, which is insane. Now we can build another thing here. Um, I think what I want to do is I want to build a couple of traps. At some point we can just start targeting a uh, building alone. And that'll make it so that... Then it'll make it so that it just makes everything a lot easier on, on us. Uh, no more workspaces, which is a bit weird. Let's focus more on the uh, science now, because it all it only take like like what like thirty five seconds to um to get overpopulated before we actually initiate a battle with the chimp or well, something. I don't know. Oh, we can buy another shield. I think once it gets to like seventeen, that's when. Well, when it gets to like 18, that's when it starts um, getting real. So once this hits zero, I think it'll uh, start initiating fights. Yep. Yeah. And what's cool is that we can just let this tick down. And it'll be pretty, pretty epic. Because now when our chimp is dead, another chimp will take its place. This is all about like automation and stuff. It's like trying to figure out the best way to automate everything uh, early on. What's cool is that I have science, which is cool. Um, dagger, and now I need to focus on metal. Because focus on metal is a good idea. So it is a good idea then, you know. Also, we're running low on uh, food storages. We're running low on food storages, which is a little weird. So we need to build a barn. And the barn will actually increase our food uh, storage by 100%. So now we can after this, we can fit 2,000 food in a, um, 
in one singular thing. Also, we can upgrade. So, we're just going to focus more on um, wood and mining. What is this? Okay, I'm not, I'm not going to buy this just yet. Uh, we're going to focus on getting to 100 metal and 300 wood. And this way we can actually um, get this to um, put more trims into working. It'll tick over in a little bit. What I want to know is I want to... We need food. We need a hut. We need a weenie hut junior. Is what we need. So while this is um going, we'll actually unlock the next upgrade, scientists. While this is moving, smoothing, smoothing and moving, um So how many silence do we need for this? We need about 160 science. Okay, so we need about 160 science. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and buy that now. Uh, make it a lot easier for me to to um do things in the future. And then what we can do is we can get this upgrade squad away. Sorry if I'm not as um enthusiastic as my other videos. Um so it's just kind of a one off thing that um I really needed to do. Uh I need some food. I need some food. I need a hut. And with this hut, we can make more room for trimps. So that takes them to the wood. That takes 119. So let's just buy those. Then we can buy a hut. Then what we can do is we can dump. We can dump some into. Um, being a miner. And we need a hundred food for a scientist. So I want to get that up. Alright, so now we have all of our resources automated somewhat. Um, it's not big automation, but it is. It is automation. It is. It is some automation. So it is some automation here. Oh boy. How is it? How is the game dying? How is the game dying? It's choppy. How is the game choppy? Is there too much going on here? Can my computer not even fucking handle this? I need, I don't need traps. Speed miner. Are you fucking kidding me? All right, so we need a lot of resources for speed miner. Let's just kick science into high gear. 
And then we can keep middle into high gear. And then what we can do is we can, you know, do shit. Probably gonna go for another few minutes uh, before we call it here in the world of shrimps. And then it'll idle, and then when we come back, it'll be good. So we are now in the world of shrimps. Ooh, look at that. Two, one. Actually, I'm going to get that one up as well. Really kicks on the shit in high gear, you know? It really kicks on the shit in high gear. What I hate is that sometimes it takes a while to get a hut or something or whatever. Well, what's cool is that I don't even have to worry about building traps now. Even though it would be a good idea to, uh, you know, kind of build stuff. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for this to, uh, tank. Tank over. Uh, we have quite a bit left to go here. So, what? What is this? Oh, I'm sharing food. Well fed. Apparently, you signed this for each time. It's way more turkey for you. Well fed. The chicken was delicious and the other photos. If you set yourself together, food would have meant what the fuck. If you can share with your workers, it to gather be about 50%. What the fuck? Also, I need to. I'm gonna have to keep wood into you. So, just get a couple of cubes in there. I don't even have to worry about mining because what I can do is I can just do... There we go. I need to make a shed. Okay, so shed me up. I run into the hut. Now what I can do is I can buy forge. It's all about, um, it's all about, like, um, it's literally all about, like, um, focusing your attention to different things. So, once we get, okay, we need wood. So I need to get to 500 wood and 200 science. Science is doing good on its own. Yeah, science is doing good on its own, and then we need a uh, speed farming. Next. Do I really want to do that yet? Tank like half my food for, or for half my food instead of getting this thing or whatever, I don't know. Uh, I think this is going to be it for the first episode of Fimps. 
Um, if you guys liked it, you want to see more gameplays like this, leave a comment below. And as always, we will collect our speed lumber, and then we'll be on our way. We'll let our chums fight in the background, or we will let them, you know, kind of, uh, you know, idle. And I will see all of you in the next video. Later.